back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my updated skincare routine for 2019. And beside me are the skincares that I've been currently using. And yung iba dito, sobrang tagal ko na ginagamit. And yung iba pa ako. And I will give you a brief review of those products. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, let's start with morning skincare routine. So for morning, I wash my face with a facial wash. This is I've been currently using. It's the Innis Free Judge Volcanic Pore Cleansing Foam. And as you can see, sobrang ubos na siya. This, is one, this one is the 80 ml and this one is the new, is the 150 ml. So usually, lagi talaga ako naglalagay ng extra para hindi na ako bibili pag naubusan na agad. So ito na yung extra ko, the Jeju Volcanic Pore Cleansing Foam from Innisfree. And so far, I've been loving it. Hindi ako nagkaka-breakout, kaya kinukontinue pa rin yung use niya. Dati ang ginagamit ko is yung green tea. But tapos nag and go with green tea ako. But this one, I feel that my face is brightened up after using and wala na siyang stinginess effect after. And my skin doesn't feel really dry. So after facial wash in the morning, what I do is to put sunblock. And sometimes if my under eye is dry, I use eye cream. So let's move on to the nighttime skincare routine. Kasi yung mas importante sa akin, yung bago matulog na skincare routine. Kahit gano'n ka papagod sa work mo or sa school or kahit gano'n ka pakadasin kung ano man yung ginawa mo before, make sure to always do your nighttime skincare routine. It's very, very important as well as your sleep. So let's start. Again, facial wash with this one. But since I have makeup or if you have makeup, double cleansing is very important. Meaning, tatanggalin mo muna yung makeup mo with any makeup remover that you have. And then you do your facial wash. So for me, this is what I've been currently using. is the Garnier Micellar Water Oil Infused Cleansing Water. Removes waterproof makeup, cleanses, and nourishes. It says here, no rinse off. Meaning, pwede daw na ito na lang. But for me, hindi ako sanay ng ganun. Yung parang hindi na ako gagamit ng facial wash after. Kasi feeling ko nandun pa rin yung makeup kahit natanggal niya na. But so far, ito yung gusto ko. Kasi hindi siya nagsisting sa eyes ko. Meron kasing mga makeup remover na mahaki sa mata or kaya binublur niya yung mata mo. Yung Vanilla Cold Balm, that one is good. As in, namimelt niya lahat ng makeup. Yun yung ginagamit ko before pero naubos na siya. Hindi niya nasisting yung eyes ko pero sometimes medyo blur yung paningin ko pag yun yung ginagamit. But with this one, I love it kasi walang stinginess, hindi blurry. So before, I tried this pore purifying sebum cleanser ng Altea. This one is okay. It's not bad. It's not that good for me kasi ito nagsisting sa eyes pero natatanggal niya yung makeup. So if you want to use this, I suggest na sa ano lang, sa face area, not sa eyes kasi in my case, ang nangyari is medyo mahati siya sa eyes. Yun lang naman. But overall, I don't have any problems with this. Hindi rin ako nag-breakout dito. I used three cotton pads. Dati ang ginagamit ko yung reusable. Pero nakakatamad maglabag girl ng reusable kasi minsan hindi siya natatanggal yung mga stain na makeup. So yeah. Since my hands are clean, always make sure that your hands are clean. So, shake muna daw ito. And then, sobrang bango to ito, guys. Akala ko nung unang hapi, shower one. Hindi rin naman ako nag-breakout dito. Sobrang bango. And then, I will put it on the cotton pad. And then, super soak to. And then, I will just remove my makeup. So, laging patas. This one. For ski light. And I do like this. Sobrang mga, as in, parang sobrang fresh lang ng feeling. Pero ayun nga, hindi ako satisfied ng ganito lang. Gusto ko nag-facial wash pa din ako. Okay. And the tint that I've been using now is, or that I use right now is the Merzee Peach Crush and then Perenzino Greeny. Lahat na lang nalagay ko sa description box. Sobrang pinap ng ganda nito. As in, magsistain talaga. So, after nyan, ayan, sobrang dirty ng cotton pad. Ikuha pa ako ng isa para lang sure na wala talagang naiiwan ng makeup. Kasi yun yung magkaklog ng pores mo at magkakaroon ng pimples. So, ulitin ko lang ginawa ko na pag -inis. Wipe up. Always wipe up. And, ayan, meron pa rin. Oh. See? So, huwag ka makontento sa isang punasan lang. And then, yung other side, yun naman yung gagamitin ko sa lips. Ayan nyo, sobrang hirap ng galin. See? Pero mag-stain pa rin talaga siya hanggang bukas to. As in, sobrang long-lasting ng lips nito to. Anyway, after that, I will still get 
last cotton pad kasi basa pa rin yung face ko. And then, i-wipe off ko lang yung excess na oil. Hindi siya oily, walang stinginess na nagaganap. As in, sobrang okay nung micellar water na yun. And meron pa konding konding na tira, so I'm okay with that. So, this is how my face looks like. Ayan, nakikita yung mga veins, dark spots here, but it's okay. Tapos, maghihilamos na ako using the Innisfree Jujuble Catech Pore Cleansing Foam. And then, let's move forward with my other skincare, okay? So, this is what my face looks like after washing. Ayan, sobrang nakabrighten talaga yung Innisfree. Sobrang gentle sa skin. Of course, since we wash mo oil, lahat ng oil sa face mo and lahat ng makeup, you have to bring back the pH palette. So, you need to use a toner. So, as you can see, pinost ko to before sa Instagram ko. This is the Bow and Bow Secret 7 Skin. This one's supposed to be 7 times mo ilalagay kay sa face mo. Pero girl, ang dami ko nang nilalagay mo kasi 7 times pa ba ako. I usually do this once or twice lang. Okay na ako dun. So, I just use my hands. I'll just pour this amount and then dab it on your face. So, that's what I usually do. After nyan, what I do is of course essence. Before, I've been using flares but sometimes pag masyado mo nang matagal ginagamit yung skincare, feeling what I've been currently using is matagal nyan nakikita to sa akin ang ilang bote ko na to. This is the Time Revolution First Treatment Essence. I think this is good for brightening up the dark spots and also good for anti-aging because it has fermented stuff on it. Basta yun siya. And then, ayan, meron siyang stopper dito. Ganun din. Same thing. I will just use my hands put a little bit on my palm. And then, actually, not a little bit. Kasi, abilis niya maubos sa akin. Hindi siya umaabot ng, ng isang taon. And then, same thing. I'll just tap it off like that. As in, super, kung gusto mo hydrated yung skin mo and mabilis mo tayo. This is perfect for you. After nyan, another important thing is eye cream. So, if may wrinkles ka na, don't assume na matatanggal ng eye cream yung wrinkles mo. It will prevent only for having more wrinkles or fine lines. For me, very important na eye cream. Kaya mahal ang eye cream. Kasi it gives more hydration, especially sa under eye. Kasi very sensitive yan and very easy na magkaroon ng lines. So what I do, or what I've been using is the Innisfree Jeju Orchid Eye Cream. Ayan, this is available sa Altea. Everything na lang guys will be on the description box. So ayan, punong-puno siya pag binili nyo. This one is 30 ml. So I usually get this amount of eye cream and then I put it like this. And then you just dab it. Hanggang mas spread mo siya pataas. Pataas para mi magsag yung face. And then you close your eyes and spread it all over. So as you can see, yung mga nalagay ko kanina, yung toner, yung essence, dry na siya. So if I feel like I need a little more moisture, what I've been currently using and then super okay sa akin ng moisturizer is the Estura Ato Barrier 365 Cream for sensitive and dry skin. So I'm not sensitive skin. I don't have dry skin that much. It depends on whether if sobrang init or sobrang lamig, I feel that my skin is a little bit dry. But I love this because in the only breakout, it gives extra hydration and parang sobrang plump the skin after. So, ito Ato Barrier, Ato Barrier S2 365. Pero siya parang maliliit na particles. I don't know if you can see. Pero siya parang maliliit na particles. Pero pag in-spread mo sa face mo, madi-dissolve siya unti-unti. So, this is what I do. Ayan. So, I will just use this finger. The ring finger kasi mas softer yan. And I will just massage my face with it. As in, hanggang pagising mo, hydrated yung face mo. And hydration and moisturizer. Moisturizing your face is one of the important things para hindi ka makaroon ng fine lines and wrinkles, you know, to prevent you from aging because you want to be forever young. Okay. I think aging is inevitable. Hindi natin may iwasan yun. But for me, aging gracefully is the best. You know, I don't know what I said, actually, medyo pagod na ako, but I want to share my updated skincare routine. At ang tagal ko na din walang upload at hindi ko nakikita kung pantay yung ginagawa ko kasi nakatingin lang ako dun sa screen ng camera, okay? What I'm here. Ayan. So, I'm just gonna spread this. 
Okay, so before, what I use on my skin instead of the uh, Estula Auto Barrier is this Serum E. I have already seen it before and as you can see, it's almost done. But right now, I used it on my neck because I told you, I'm a bit sensitive to the ano, smell. I don't want to get rid the smell. This Estula has no smell, so it's super okay for me to spread all over my face. But the Serum E is okay also for anti-aging, but I use it on my neck na lang, like this. Ayan. And then I spread it upwards. So what you put on your face, make sure that you put it on your neck, especially um moisturizer, creams, uh, uh, sunblock. Very important. Di ko pa na share sunblock ko na. Anyways, I'll share it to you guys later. Pagtapos sa lahat ng aking skincare. And then last step that I do in the morning, I do use lip balm. But at night, I use lip sleeping mask. Ito pa rin yung ginagamit ko, yung Kernel Sleeping Lip Care for Sleeping Mask. This one, as in, sobrang nakapanda niya lahat ng ginagamit ko lang yung finger ko, yung buwa ko. And as you can see, and half na ata siya. And I'll put it on my lips like this. And then I'll just spread it. And then pagkising ko, when I wipe it with tissue, yung dead skin cells, as in, nakapanda niya talaga. So that is it for my nighttime skincare routine, guys. I hope everything is helpful and everything will be on the description box. Yung talaga usually kung ginagamit. Okay, in the morning, what I use is, of course, I wash my face with the Innisfree, which I talked kanina. And then, sometimes if my under eye is dry, I'll use again the eye cream. If hindi naman, I will use sunblock. So, sabi sa inyo favorite ko is the Clairs Everyday Sun Protector Soft Airy UV Essence. It's lightweight. It's good for sensitive skin, dry skin, normal to oily skin, walang white cast, and very lightweight talaga. As in, parang wala akong nag-feel na may something sa face ko. Kaya super love ko to. And definitely repurchase it. Pero ang tagal niya maubos, guys. This one is 80 ml and last year ko pa siyang ginagamit. If feeling ko mas matindi yung araw sa labas, this is what I will use. The Celsi Fusion Laser Sunscreen. But this one, medyo pricey siya. Compare dito, this one is... Like 30, lang ata to eh. 50 ml. This one is 80 ml. So, pag mas matindi yung araw, pag everyday use, this is perfect. You can go out with this as well. Pero kung feeling ko sobrang init talaga, if mag beach or parang hapon ako a alis, this is what I will use. Especially if gusto ko medyo mas lighten up or mas brighten up yung skin ko, at yung like, gagamitin ko kasi mas magbibigay siya ng white and skin tone. Anyways, yun lang, yun lang naman. And for the lips, I use any lip balm. You can use any lip balm that you have. So that is it for today's video, guys. I hope this video was helpful. Again, everything will be on the description box if you want to check it out. Plus, there are links para sa mga magtatalo. And if you have any more questions, feel free to comment down below. And I'll see you again on my next video or vlog. Bye, guys!